You know what makes me sick? You know what makes me so mad? I want to force feed a kerosene cocktail to a fire eater. Sometimes people ask me if I'm going to ever get another dog. I nix the idea ever since old Buster went on to meet his maker after a face-off with a garbage truck. Still, sometimes I do think about it. I see, a, I see a lot of people walking the dog in the park, and I got to say, you, you can really tell a lot about people by what kind of dogs they're walking. If some guy's walking one of them little poofy white toy dogs, you know, a poodle or a Maltese or something like that, you know he's one of two things. One, a wuss. Or two, it really ain't his choice of dog, but his wife put him on walking duties. Which brings us back to wuss. Now, a guy who walks a bull mastiff for a Rottweiler is a real man. Either that, or he's trying to compensate for something else. Only his wife would know for sure. A guy who walks one of them loud, yappy dogs look like a terrier or a Pomeranian. That's a guy that hates his neighbors. A guy with a bulldog is a guy who's grumpy and slow. A guy with a French bulldog is grumpy, slow, and ungrateful. And by the way, if you do get a French bulldog, good luck finding any dog child made of cheese and snails. People that get them little chihuahuas are people that travel a lot. And they want a dog that fits in the glove compartment. It's very convenient. Finally, anybody that's got a shit zoo... Well, I'd say more about that, but I'm just too embarrassed to talk about this dog in mixed company. Wake up, America! I once mentioned that breed to my mom and got my mouth washed out. Anyhow, I ain't too sure I won't get another dog. It's bad enough my wife and kids sit around all day scratching at fleas. I'm a pizza American, pizza.